there. My name is Russell Smith and I'm the Instructional Technology Facilitator for Fuqua Arena High School as well as Carpenter Elementary. Today I have a really short, really tiny tech tidbit for you. It's really cool, especially for those in high school who are trying to get prepared for the SAT or the ACT need us to brush up on their vocabulary. This tool helps you do it. The tool is called ProfessorWord.com P-R-O-F-E-S-S-O-R-W-O-R-D.com. There is no sign-up involved. There's no installation except, well, one installation. I'm going to show you how it works. I pull up the website right here. And as you can see, if, as I scroll down, you have a little tab that says Save Word, Word, Professor Word for free. Now, this works in Chrome. It works in Firefox. It has not seemed to work in Internet, Internet Explorer but the installation for this uh, little add-on to your bookmarks bar works in either Chrome or in Firefox. So all you need to do is hold down and, and drag the button up to your bookmarks bar. And you can see this is located right there. And it says Run Professor Word. So all what it does is it identifies any website you go to any article, what it does, it, it, it scans it and identifies which words on the website are considered to be SAT words or ACT words. So, for example, I'm going to flip on over to the Washington Post. And this is the first time I've seen this. I'm going to click on this article about Iran turns down U.S. request against the Islamic State. And scroll down to the beginning of the article. I'm going to click on my add-on for Run Professor Word, and you can see how quickly, how quickly it scanned the article. And you can see this tab here, it found 46 SAT or SAT words are found. There's a user guide available, you can uh, choose your preferences if you want to make adjustments. But what I'm going to do here is I'm going to click this closed, and you can see that it is highlighted many of the words in the article. If I go up to the word militant, for example, and I click on militants, it gives me, a, a, what militants is another form of militant, it gives me what type of speech it is, it's a noun, it can also be used as an adjective, and it gives, so it gives you several different definitions, and it also gives you a source. So if you don't know what underscoring is, you can click on this. All you have to do is click on the word. A little pop-up box appears. Now maybe maybe I, I planned this. I didn't plan this. I'm going to go on over to another website, which is wrl.com, which is more local. I'm going to click on one for Nicole showing Hagen widening lead. This is a more local website. Click on Run Professor Word. It scans the article. And it found 13 SAT or ACT words. In this case, we can see the word insights is highlighted in purple here. So when we click on it, we can kind of, I'm not sure what the difference is and why it colored it a different color. But I'm sure it has, it has its reasons. So anyway, that's a really quick, tiny tech tidbit, as I mentioned. It's ProfessorWord.com. Go ahead and install it. And uh, I'll talk, see you next time for another Tech Tidbit. Thank you for watching.